All right, guys, let's just start it off with this. They're making over $30,000 a month. That's it. <laughs> All right, let's get started, guys. In this video, we are going to be actually talking about a application on Shopify. And I usually do portfolio reviews for developers, but now I want to implement this to the channel. I want to show you guys applications that, you know, developers have created and you know independently are making income for themselves okay sometimes you know you think like hey i need to be working at google i need to be in a huge company or i need to create uh an amazing application that's huge and is going to continue to grow to you know the next facebook right and sometimes you know just creating an application that solves a problem right can be very beneficial for you guys as developers right now i'm doing this because nobody else is going to do this nobody's going to show you guys the actual apps that people are making out here and the different avenues and paths that you guys can take as developers so let's get started right now this application is called game ball i actually just found this application from an advertisement okay as you guys may know i'm super deep into shopify apps i myself have a shopify agency right where we're building themes and we're building custom applications for customers and we're also launching our own applications by the way if you want to learn how to build shopify apps i'm going to leave a link below okay on how to get to learn that right and you could just go to codingphase.com search for shopify and you're going to see it there i have two courses one for theme development and one for app development it's up to you if you want to take it okay um but let's just get into it so i found this app through over here through this ad and i said you know what this seemed pretty cool make customers fall in love with your store with a game like loyalty and rewards program from game ball i said cool let me check that out and the fact that you know they're charging up to a hundred dollars per month and then they're like hey man you could get it for 39.99 right hey they're making some bread okay that's how i look at it i'm like okay if they are able to charge a hundred dollars for an application when most applications on shopify are like ten dollars then that means they have a really solid application and i want to check it out so i decided to go through the shopify store and find them right seems like a legit uh application pretty nice they have support for seven languages they even have sdks for uh native and react native ios uh, android sdks right uh a lot of good information in here they integrate with judge me uh, clavio hubspot active campaign omnisend drip right so they're doing their thing okay and then from there i checked out this video that they have okay i don't know if we can see this here let me see if we could actually see this uh let's see i think i'm gonna have to go to the to the youtube channel for this uh, but pretty much this is a preview of the application right it shows you um what it is it shows you like a nice animation you get to give rewards to your customers every single time that they either buy a new product or uh, they come in and actually you know share a product and somebody buys a product or they add it to the cart right and there's a lot of like little things that you guys can definitely check out if you guys want to go more into the details of this application but again it's a rewards program okay pretty much it's, it's like a video game you have different levels that you can achieve you get different points uh depending on on what you get you can say you know what if somebody gets twenty thousand points that's twenty dollars that, that you can take out right the dashboard seems pretty simple pretty straightforward uh we're setting up the different rewards okay um the integration to the applications or the integration with the apps itself or the the themes seems pretty seamless right and that's something that i really you know i really respect because i understand the whole process of how they build this type of application but at the same time it's the fact that they were so creative with it that i respect right and at the same time that they put the the time and the details like everything from the icons to the way how it looks like this is a legit application this wasn't built like in somebody's basement and they say hey guys we're gonna build this thing and we're just gonna make it with whatever hey let's let's throw bootstrap at it now they took their time they had an idea they built it right and now they you know getting the rewards of you know building such a great application uh from reading the reviews people love it 
right? Of course, you might see uh, one or two bad situations, which happens all the time. Like I saw uh, one of the reviews in here where somebody was like pissed off or something like that. <laughs> and I just read it because I'm like, like reading it and I'm like, most likely it's like a one off situation that happened, right? And somebody's writing all of this negative uh, thing. And it's like, yo, they're trying to help the person out. They're like, hey, man, we're going to upgrade your account. We're going to help you out. We're going to see what's going on. Most likely it has something to do with the theme, right? I mean, that's me just guessing, right? I don't know the whole details, but it could be something with the theme. Uh, maybe you couldn't track the, the rewards or maybe uh, something with the way how maybe they must have multiple applications or something, something happening, right? So there's going to be bugs just like in any type of application. And I feel for them because as you guys may know, I deal with customer service myself. I have multiple companies, right? And now we're jumping into the Shopify apps game too. So we're going to have to deal with customers no matter what. Um, <laughs> but I, I definitely understand them. But one thing that I really like was the way how they pretty much answered it. And it's like, hey, man, we're trying to work with you. We're trying to do this. You know, you're pretty much a one-off situation, right? But of course, like I said, there's a whole bunch of different reviews in here. And the majority of them, if you see right here, is like nothing but good reviews. Now, one thing that really caught my attention was, you know, they got over 1,200 merchants. That means like 1,200 stores. It could be either in Shopify or it could be in multiple platforms because uh, from my understanding, uh, their application not only connects with Shopify, but also connects with WooCommerce, okay? This is how it is, guys, right? Not only do you create your application, because once again, it's just a web application. When you create the Shopify apps, you're really creating a web application that connects to a store through Shopify's APIs or uh, different things like, them what's the name webhooks right so you're basically connecting through there right and then you could take those same things and transfer it over to different platforms like woocommerce and magento okay this is the way to go kids for those of you guys that is looking to learn how to make applications you got to follow guys like this this is the right way of doing it okay um but like I said, this is a great application. It looks pretty legit. Um, it has a lot of different things in here, a lot of features. Uh, the design is beautiful. It's definitely going to make it stand out compared to everybody else that I've seen on Shopify. And at the same time, what I really like about uh, this guy is, is pretty much, you know, when I click in here on the press kit to see more information, right? Um, basically our story, Hey, most humans experience, uh, experiences are now online from social interactions, etc. right? Uh, five countries, five industries, you know, 500,000 users plus. Okay. And then from there, you know, we see the, the team, right? Ahmed Kari, uh, Ahmed El Asi, Omar Afar. Now, I don't know too much, right? But I will say they're probably somewhere in the middle East. Most likely I, I feel like Egypt, Egypt, or, you know, maybe, I don't know. <laughs> if I'm telling you guys where I think they might be from, I, I don't know, right? It could be from Israel. I don't even know from where. But at the same time, I could say somewhere in the, you know, Middle East, Turkey, around there, right? But that's what I love about them, right? Because they're making bread, and this is like an international company, right? It's a group of individuals that decided to come up with this idea, right? And I'm pretty sure they just came up with it and said, you know what? Let's build it. Let's get it done, okay? These are not the guys that are focusing on, on what's faster, a for loop or a wow loop. This is not the guys that are worrying about, hey, man, what's going on with Node.js? Do we focus on Dino.js? Do we drop everything that we're doing, guys, and let's now focus on Dino.js, right? Like, they're not doing that. If we look in here, let's see what they're using for this. Uh, they're using basically WordPress uh, for the landing page of this uh, application. And you know what? It w I wouldn't be surprised if they're using something like PHP Laravel for their application or they're using something like Node.js Core. Okay. All right. So I wouldn't be surprised. All right. But like I said, 
I'm super happy that they're out there and they're making bread. And one thing that we could get as developers out of this whole situation, and, and this is how you do research, right? This is how you find, you know, applications and find companies that you can look up to and say, damn, I like what they're doing. Let me see if I could learn from them, right? Um, you know, even from something as negative as a stupid review from somebody that had a bad experience, you can still learn a lot from that, right? We can say, hey, man, they're making, you know, 1,200 merchants, right? Even from that, if we bring out the calculator, bring out the calculator, Joe, okay? <laughs> bring out the calculator for them, okay? We got the calculator here, kids, okay? We could say 1,200, right? That's 1,200, right? 1,200 merchants. Now, let's say, for example, right, we come in and we see the pricing on this. They have a free to install tier, okay? So you could try out the website if you have 500 customers already on your list, okay? Then from there, anything above that is going to be uh, basically 0.5 or basically 0 0.05, which is $0.05 cents per customer. That adds up little by little. If you decide to say, you know what? I have a thousand customers. Okay. I'm going to go with the $30 a month. Okay. Now we're talking about 0 0.03 dollars, uh, 0 0.03 dollars, which is three cents, you know, per, uh, customer above a thousand, right? Same thing over here. We say, Hey, if a store has 5,000 customers, right? It's $99. That's a lot. You know, it, it, it might not seem like a lot, but it's a lot for this type of application. But you know, if they're charging that is because they know that they can get it in their quality of work is, you know, it's top notch at the same time from reading the reviews, they do have a uh, customer support that seems pretty legit. Okay. They answer right away. So this is how you scale. You get what I'm saying? Like you start with simple applications. Okay. Or even start with one application that in the beginning seems simple. And then from there you surround yourself with a team. So now, this guys, they've gotten to the point where we just going to keep it at the, you know, the smallest level that there is. Let's say out of those 1200 people, each one of them is just paying, you know, let's say $30, which is $29, right? Let's say $29. Okay. That's $34,000 a month. Okay. Now let's say, you know, on average, right? There's a mixture between people paying $29 and an average between people paying $99. Let's just keep it at, let's say $65, right? So we got $1,200, right? And then we come in and we say, cool. Uh, this is 12,000. Sorry, guys. <laughs> 1,200, right? Times, let's say 65, okay? That's $78,000 a month, okay? Even if... You probably think like, is that a lot? Uh, trust me, it's a lot, <laughs> right? It's a lot, right? And even at that, I still believe that, you know, they still have a lot of, uh, you know, room to grow. That's why they are running ads and, and Facebook ads because they're about to take it up a notch. You get what I'm saying? Now, this is the type of companies that nobody talks about. This is the type of companies that, you know, it's not sexy to say, Hey man, I'm working at Gumbo or a game Boy, right? I'm working over here. Right. But this is the type of applications and companies that, you know, make a difference. Right. And for me, their motivation, right? This is the type of people that I look up to. This is the type of people that I'm interested on, right? This is why I'm bringing it to you guys. It's a great application, right? Uh, for anybody watching this in the future, this is for developers, right? This is not in a review for the users. This is for developers so we can learn from this company. Uh, I'm going to see if I could email them, right? If you guys are watching, guys, hit me up, codingphase at gmail.com. I would love to interview you guys and, and just to find out a little bit more about your, your tech stack and, and see how you guys uh, built this or maybe, you know, just to give more um, insight to what you guys are building and what other applications you guys might have. OK, uh, but yeah, man, this is great. You know, this is what I'm talking about. You know what I mean? Like this is software as a service, B2B, right? Business to business type of transactions. And, you know, this is what I feel like us who are trying to focus on making income independent income as developers this is the type of applications that we need to really pay attention to okay so i hope you guys like this video hopefully you guys enjoy this and learn something from this okay 
and just to put you guys on game okay put you guys on what's going on in the e-commerce world all right there's a lot of opportunities out here just like in any other field and at the same time if you want to learn this guys you got to go to codingphase.com right we literally have the best courses when it comes to shopify development and shopify apps right uh, and even to create themes like literally this is the wave this is the future this is what you guys should be focusing on applications like this if you want to become an independent developer okay this is like the same thing that guys do when they are indie game developers right and they come in and they come out with a a brand new game that's a, a smash hit right and you know you see those guys that are making games and somehow are making a living this is the type of things that we need to be making as web developers to be making a living independently without having to work for somebody 24 7. okay it is what it is guys it's your boy joe back at it again codingface.com make sure you subscribe make sure you like this video and let me know what you think do you like this type of videos or not okay let me know you survived to the end put the letter j if you did take care guys peace I almost left without mentioning this but they actually got real customers you get what i'm saying sometimes if you look at the reviews of a lot of applications that's out there there's customers that are not real right i looked through their reviews and i actually you know real stores are actually using them okay and it would be cool to find out that they're actually using this on their pos system i don't know if they have it connected to the pos system but just to give you guys the you know like the power of the shopify apps that you guys can create right just the idea that this is a real store that right now they have you know they're selling coffee themselves right they, they're brewing their own freaking coffee making their own freaking uh flavors etc right I'm, I'm not a coffee guy so i don't know what the what what the coffee mark is like but this is a real store right this is a real store and if i'm not mistaken this is in australia right aussie veterans coffee this is one of the people that i saw on the reviews because i said you know what let me actually google this let me see if i find this out there right so i said let me check out some of the stores and, and there are real stores okay so the reviews are actually real you know <laughs> one thing that you're gonna find a lot of times is that people be bsing on their reviews you know they'll go in and create fake stores but this is a real store a real business also veterans coffee co right it's a real store and it's just cool to actually see it in action like it makes me want to order some coffee from here just to see how the whole process goes right create an account win 100 points earn one point one score for every one dollar you spent okay unlock badges okay etc right follow on instagram win 25 points uh like on facebook win 25 points and 500 on score etc right so there's a lot of things that you can get with this application and it's just cool to see it in person like in in, in action okay it's actually out there all right <laughs> so i just wanted to mention that before we leave all right i'll see you guys later peace <laughs>